Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice Diophantine equation a plus 3ab plus b squared is equal to 29. We need to find all possible values of a and b, where a and b are positive integers. It means a must be greater than 0 and b must be greater than 0. Now, let's start by multiplying both sides of this equation by 3. So, this will become 3 times a plus 9 times a b plus 3 b squared is equal to 29 times 3 87. Next, 3 a from these two terms 9 a b plus 3 b squared we can factor out plus 3b and in bracket left 3a plus b is equal to 87. Now, because here inside parentheses we have 3a plus b. So, to make this 3a same as this 3a plus b, we add b to both sides of this equation. So, this will become 3a plus b plus 3b times 3a plus b is equal to 87 plus b. We have added this b at both sides. Now, we use parentheses to make this a group and from here we can factor out this 3a plus b. So, 3a plus b as common factor and in bracket left 1 plus 3 times b is equal to 87 plus b. Now, we move this plus b to the left hand side, then this will become 3 times a plus b times this 1 plus 3b can be written as 3b plus 1. This plus b will become negative b at left hand side is equal to 87. Now, because here we have 3 times b, so we multiply both sides of this equation by 3. So, this will become 3 times 3a plus b times 3b plus 1 minus 3 times b is equal to 87 times 3 will become 261. Now, this 3 times this expression will become 9 times a plus 3b times this 3b plus 1 minus 3b is equal to 261. Now, we subtract 1 from both sides. So, this will become 9a plus 3 times b times 3b plus 1 minus 3b minus 1 is equal to 260. Next, 9a plus 3 times b times 3b plus 1. From these two terms, we can factor out negative 1. Negative 1 as common factor and in bracket left 3 times b plus 1 is equal to 260. Now, as you can see this expression 3 b plus 1 is common. So, we factor out this 3 b plus 1 and in bracket left in bracket left this 9 a plus 3 b and this negative 1 in bracket left 9 a plus 3 times b minus 1 is equal to 260. Now, we have two factors at left hand side and this 260 can be factorized 1 times 260 or 260 times 1 and 2 times 130 or 130 times 2 and 
4 times 65 or 65 times 4 and 5 times 52 or 52 times 5 and 10 times 26 or 26 times 10 and 13 times 20 or 20 times 13. So, we have six cases here. This is case 1, this is case 2, this is case 3, this is case 4, this is case 5 and this is case 6. First, uh, we solve case 1. Case 1 is uh, 1 times 260 or 260 times 1. In this part, we write this 3b plus 1, 3 times b plus 1 equal to 1. And we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 260. And in the second part, we write this 3b plus 1, 3b plus 1 equal to 260 and we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 1. Now, from this equation we find the value of b is equal to 0 and from this equation we put value of b 0 in this equation then this will become 9 times a plus 3 times 0 will become 0 and we move this uh, negative 1 to the right hand side, it will become 261. And from here, we get the value of A 29. So, from this part, we get value of A 29 and value of B 0. So, we get first pair of solutions uh, 29 comma 0. Now, from this part, uh, we get the value of B from here. Uh, 259 over 3 that is not an integer. So, no integer solutions can be found from this part. Now, we solve this second case 2 times 130 or 130 times 2. In case 2, we have 2 times 130 or 130 times 2. So, in this part, we write this 3b plus 1, 3 times b plus 1 equal to 2 and we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 130. And in the second part, we write this 3b plus 1 3 times b plus 1 equal to 130 and we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 2. From this equation, we get the value of b is equal to 1 over 3. So, no integer solutions can be found from this part. And from this part, if we subtract 1 from both sides, then this will become 3b is equal to 129. And if we divide both sides by 3, we get the value of b 43. Now, in this equation, we replace this b with this 43. So, this will become 9 times a plus 3 times 43 minus 1 is equal to 2. Next, 9a, 3 times 43 is uh, plus 129, minus 1 is equal to 2. Next, 9 times a plus 128 is equal to 2, and 9a is equal to 2 minus 128. This will become 9a is equal to negative 126 and if we divide both sides by 9, we get the value of a negative 14. So, from this part, we get value of a negative 14 and value of b 43. 
so from here we get another pair negative 14 comma 43 now we solve case 3 case 3 is 4 times 65 or 65 times 4 case 3 is 4 times 65 or 65 times 4 in this part we write this as 3b plus 1 3 times b plus 1 equal to 4 and we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 65 and in the second part we write this 3b plus 1 3 times b plus 1 is equal to 65 and we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 4 from this equation we get the value of b is equal to 1 so in this equation we replace this b with 1 so this will become 9 times a plus 3 times 1 minus 1 is equal to 65 and 9a 3 times 1 is 3 and 3 minus 1 plus 2 is equal to 65 and 9a is equal to if we subtract 2 from both sides this will become 63 and if we divide both sides by 9 then we get the value of a 7 so from this part we get value of a 7 and value of b 1 so another pair of solutions is 7 comma 1 now from this part we get the value of b is equal to 64 over 3 so no integer solutions can be found from this part now we solve case 4 case 4 is 5 times 52 and 52 times 5 case 4 is equal to 5 times 52 or 52 times 5 so in this part we write this 3b plus 1 3b plus 1 equal to 5 and we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 52 and in the second part we write 3 times b plus 1 equal to 52 and we write 9 times a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 5 from this equation we get the value of b is equal to 4 over 3 so no integer solutions can be found from this part now from this equation we get value of b is equal to 17 so we replace this b with this 17 we get 9a plus 3 times 17 minus 1 is equal to 5 next 9 times a plus 3 times 17 will become 51 minus 1 is equal to 5 9a 51 minus 1 plus 50 is equal to 5 and if we subtract 50 from both sides we get 9a is equal to negative 45 and if we divide both sides by 9 we get the value of a negative 5 so from this part we get the value of a negative 5 and value of b 17 so we get another pair negative 5 comma 17 now we solve case 5 case 5 is 10 times 26 or 26 times 10 in case 5 we have 10 times 26 or 26 times 10 so in this part we write this 3b plus 1 3b plus 1 equal to 10 
we write this uh, 9a plus 3b minus 1, 9a plus uh, 3b minus 1 equal to 26. And in the second part, we write uh, 3 times b plus 1 equal to 26 and uh, 9a plus uh, 3b minus 1 equal to 10. From this equation, we get the value of b is equal to 3. So, we replace uh, this b with this 3. So, this will become 9 times a plus uh, 3 times 3 will become 9 minus 1 is equal to 26. And uh, 9a is equal to 9 minus 1 is 8 and this will become 26 minus 8. So, this will become 9a is equal to 18 and if we divide both sides by 9, we get the value of a 2. So, from this part, we get the value of a 2 and value of b 3. We get another pair 2 comma 3 from this part. Now, from this part, we get the value of b is equal to 25 over 3. So, no integer solutions can be formed from this part. Now, we solve case 6. Case 6 is 13 times 20 and 20 times 30. Case 6 is 13 times 20 or 20 times 13. So, from this part, we write this 3b plus 1, 3 times b plus 1 equal to 13. And we write this 9a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 20. And in the second part, we write 3b plus 1 equal to 20 and 9 times a plus 3b minus 1 equal to 13. Now, from this equation, we get the value of b is equal to 4. And we replace this b with 4. So, this will become 9 times a plus 3 times 4 minus 1 is equal to 20. And this will become 9a plus 12 minus 1 is equal to 20. Next, 9a is equal to 12 minus 1 is 11. And we subtract 11 from 20, this will become 9. And if we divide both sides by 9, we get the value of a 1. So, from this case, we get value of a 1 and value of b 4. So, we get another pair 1 comma 4. Now, from this equation, we get the value of b is equal to 19 over 3. So, no integer solutions can be found from this part. So, we get the pairs of solutions of a comma b is equal to 20 9 comma 0 and negative 14 comma 43 and 7 comma 1 and negative 5 comma 17 and 2 comma 3 and 1 comma 4. Now, because A must be greater than 0 and B must be greater than 0. So, this pair 29 comma 0 will be rejected, this negative 14 comma 43 will be rejected and this negative 5 comma 17 will be rejected. 